wishes have been granted. Farewell. This one seems a little different than all those other pathetic specimens. I'll tear you limb from limb! Well, it may be capable of speaking, but it seems just as pitifully stupid as the others. Oh well, might as well kill a little time with a display of my superior strength. Just another Cretan, but you actually have a modicum of skill. Well, I did go a little easy on you, but you still survived my attacks. Uh, wait, please. Is that you? What, Frieza? Oh, oh, so you do know your place after all. Please, forgive me! It's me, Nappa, the Saiyan. I used to work for you. Don't you remember me? Nappa. Now that you mention it, that name does ring a bell. My apologies, Lord Frieza! It, it just... You, you've changed forms from, from when I last had the honor of meeting you. Oh, so this was the first time you've seen me in my current form, then? Still, if one cannot recognize one's master, does that not constitute an absence of loyalty? Oh, of course not! Come hell or high water, I would do your bidding to the letter, Lord Frieza. I wouldn't need to test you on that statement now, would I? But if you do mean it, you will devote your life to serving me. Is that clear? That wasn't terrible. Seems like you might have a knack for this. If you can tap into a little more of my power, we should be able to interrogate Android 16. Silence, fool. I do not care what you prefer. What could possibly be wrong with punishing a fool like him? I urge you to learn your place. There is no doubt about it. You can't actually believe anything that comes out of that man's mouth. If so, you are a puke-inducing simpleton. I don't know what his true goal is, but he must be hiding something. Oh, I see. Now I understand. It seems like he originally intended to link you with that Saiyan up That Saiyan? Hey, you talking about Kakarot? And since when have you been allowed to speak to me in that manner? Shall I remove that big mouth of yours? Oh, no, no, Lord Frieza. It was just my misunderstanding. I thought it was the maggot inside of you speaking, Lord Frieza. <laughs> I sincerely hope that's the case. Napa, even you could prove to be an important pawn in a situation this dire. I trust you know what will happen if you don't show adequate results. Of course I do, sir! I won't let you down! Now that's more like it. I expect great things from you. <laughs> the 
that Frieza is such a jerk. Did you say something? No, sir, not a thing! <laughs> ah, Captain Ginyu, you have returned to life at a most opportune moment. Come along, then. You work for me now. Beware, you little fool! I'll destroy anybody who gets in my way! First he forgets to pose, and then he ignores Lord Frieza's direct command? It does seem that you forgot your place under me when you fixed that odd little posing habit of yours. My dear Captain, I'll see to it you remember who follows the orders around here and who will be the one giving them. I cannot accept insurrection in the ranks. However, I'm willing to let it slide just this once, as I am in need of able-bodied fighters. Lord Frieza? Do... do you really mean that? I do. But in exchange, I expect you to serve me until your dying breath. Thank you, Lord Frieza. You have my word. I promise I won't let you down again. Listen up! The merciful Lord Frieza has given us a chance to return to his army. Now we will express our eternal joy and gratitude in the form of a dance! You really needn't bother. Oh, as you wish, my lord. Pardon my asking, Lord Frieza. Is it really a good thing they're back to normal? Seems to me they were better off the way they were before. I see your point. But in my army, all that matters is results. Very good. Now that we have Captain Ginyu with us, I would say things are going quite well. Lord Frieza, are you sure it's okay to let that Earthling Freeloader remain in your body? Of course not. I detest the thought. But I need that maggot to draw out all of my power. When you consider the dangers we face, letting a maggot roost in one's body doesn't seem that bad. All things considered, I'd like to gather us some more pawns, however. So, they revived you, too. Now, things are getting interesting. Hey! What business do you have with Lord Frieza? My name is Cell. I would be more than happy to join, if you're sure you want to play. What? Behave, Nappa! You will soon learn that. Smart mutts know when to stop their barking. But, but sir! Nappa, Lord Frieza gave you an order. Your subordinates seem rather undisciplined. Is the Frieza Force nothing but a group of halfwits? Hey, you better watch your tongue. Captain Ginyu. I think it's best to hear what Bug Boy has to say. <laughs> Lord Frieza just saved your life, punk. All right, then. Let's get down to business. Where is the being who revived me? Allow some strange soul to take complete control of my body. Strange soul? You mean they did the same thing to you? Perhaps she plans to utilize many more people than we realized. 
Excuse me? Did you say she? So you do know something about this? Even if we did, who says we need to share this with you? I... First, you need to show me some respect. Ask me nicely, and I just may consider it. <laughs> what an unbelievably banal request. I don't care what you do. Tell me everything you know. I see. It would appear that this fellow is much slower in the head than I first assumed. Isn't that special? No matter. I'll just have to teach you the hard way. I guess it's not that bad. You seem much different from the data I have on you. It's like you've become something completely different all of a sudden. Why is it, Frieza? I'm getting the sense there's another energy inside you. You are somehow different from me. Like you've been possessed by another being's soul. If we're so different, then please explain what it is inside of you. Ah, well that is another story. I have something akin to an artificial soul that has been pre-programmed, which would explain why I find it so easy to control. What? You can control the soul inside you? Indeed. In fact, it was so easy to overpower that I didn't even need to waste my time and effort expelling it. Hmm. I don't know who's inside of you right now. But thanks to their soul, your full power is at your disposal. I'm correct, aren't I? Surely, being linked with this Earthling must be what allowed me to tap into some of my power. Although, my true power is so much greater than this. Interesting. There must be some logical mistake then. The data I have on you must be outdated. Amusing. Hold thou. I allow you to come and work for me. Lord Frieza, if I may, I don't believe it would do us well to work with this creature. I agree. There's no telling when that freak might betray us. None of this matters. Cell doesn't work for anyone. However, you could all prove to be of actual use to me. I suppose I don't mind teaming up. So be it. I suppose there are small benefits in a group effort. Nevertheless, if you prove useless or dare to betray me, then I will be forced to erase you. No, our feelings. <laughs> the same goes for both sides. 